let me study the question which one of the following statements regarding selective leaching of a binary alloy is true option a the lower atomic weight element is leached option b the element having higher diffusivity is leached option c the more electronegative element is leached and option d the element with lower density is leached so let us look at what selective leaching means selective leaching also known as de-alloying is a form of corrosion that is observed only in alloys most commonly in binary alloys where the elements of the alloy will have high electrode potential difference one of the elements in the alloy will get selectively removed or leached hence the name selective leaching specifying to the alloy systems it is also mentioned in different names such as de-zincification where zinc is selectively removed from brass which is copper zinc alloy denickelification where nickel is removed selectively from nickel copper alloy that is monal dealuminumification where aluminum is removed selectively from aluminum bronze and graphitic corrosion or graphitization which is found in cast irons where iron is getting leached when these alloys are exposed to corrosive environment depending on the electrochemical potential of the individual elements the more noble element will act as an anode and it stays back in the alloy the more active element will act as a cathode and will be leached or removed in this table we can see standard reduction potentials of different metals in water at 25 degree celsius as we have already seen selective leaching occurs in alloy systems where the electrode potential difference is high and the elements having lower or negative electrode potential will be removed and the difference between the potentials is the driving force for de-alloying process to take place from this table for brass alloy zinc is having minus 0.76 volt electrode potential and copper is having plus 0.34 volt as electrode potential so zinc will be removed from the brass alloy and in case of aluminum brands aluminum having electrode potential of minus 1.66 will be leached and in case of monal alloy nickel having minus 0.28 volt will be removed in addition the change in atomic weight diffusivity and the density will not have a dependency on selective leaching or de-alloying so the suitable option is option c that is the more electronegative element is leached which is the answer